Good evening and welcome to Connections Live, the show that connects you to your community. I'm Michael Kanapasik. And I'm Ellen Bryan. Thanks for joining what us. What are you guys doing hey, here? What, what are you doing here? Get off our show. This, this is a live is show. Uh, what, oh, what are you guys doing? they got a girl co-host oh just like our gosh. show. How are you doing? Hi. Nice yeah. to Kenny meet you. Oh, hi. I'm Shane McGuire, Shane. Uh, okay. host of BSU Late Night. What's BSU Late Night? Is it a <laughs> What's BSU Late Night? Who is this BS, BSU Late Night. You know, it's, it's like your show, but funnier. Okay. With, with less of an audience, too. I, I thought it was that huh. thing over at the student center where they, they play the games, you Common have some fun. Misconception. That yeah. How many times have we gone through we this? Every okay, day, every day. That's BSU oh. late that's BS N I T E. Hmm. So there's the difference. You know, our show is like a late night talk show mixed yeah. with sketch comedy, uh. mixed with. Th this well, show's yeah, live yeah, right now on TV. So oh, you're live? Yeah, I've wasted your hey, audience. Hey, Mom, what's going yeah, on? Guys, is this how you guys act on your show, too? I every mean, is day. We act. Every huh. day. Uh -huh. Pop and yeah. drop it. So, so why are you guys here again? Oh, you haven't heard. Mm -mm. Live from Muncie. It's, it's BSU Late Night. night. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, thank you. It's great to be back. Uh, I've been I've been gone the last few episodes, so welcome. It's yeah. BSU late <coughs> Where night. Where have you been? I, I actually, it, you said, be okay. Against what you said, I did not get in a limousine with two strippers, Mom. He was lying. No, that was the truth. We saw you true. screaming zinger. With three women. Totally false. Totally false. That's that's no, completely true. That's horrible. Well, where were you and, if you weren't there? Well, I was doing something very important. I was on a mission trip. You on a mission trip. I went on a, a big old mission trip. Well, what'd you do? And it was a it was a very serious situation. Uh, I actually went to a place called Purdue University, <laughs> and there's a lot of stuff, horrible things going on there. What? Like and I syphilis? just want you. Well, n no, no, not syphilis. <laughs> There's just horrible things going on, and if you want to, you know, donate or, or want to learn more about what is going on in Purdue University, go to purdueuniversity.edu, and you can see some pictures there of uh, the, things, the things going on there. It's horrible. But enough about them. Enough about them. Let's get to some news. Uh, a recently built dam in China has been receiving complaints. Apparently, the farmers downstream of the area are saying that ever since the dam was built, they have been getting less water to water their crops. That's strange. When they all decided it was a good idea to build a giant wall in the river, what exactly did they think was going to happen? I have no idea. Let's build a wall in our river. We'll get lots more water. <laughs> China. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Sorry, Lee. Um, all oh. of your fans of uh, Kate Goslin, uh, you're probably still crying about uh, the vote. She got voted off of Dancing with the Stars. And for those of you who are upset of her leaving, have no fear. Word on the street is that she is trying out for a new reality show called Don't Forget You Still Have Kids at Home. She's Ouch. She's a horrible mother. That's, she and now she's that. not a viewer of our show. What's she doing? <laughs> if she was before. Yeah. Um, uh, the Ball State Police Department, this is interesting, spent $19,300 on 10 new AR-15 assault rifles. That's pretty serious stuff, Shane. And accessories. Now listen to this. $20,000 divided into 10 guns, right. that is $2,000 a gun. Yes. I ventured on over to the west side of Muncie, purchased an assault rifle for $1,000. That means... They are spending $1,000 on accessories for these guns. What kind of accessories are we talking about? I have no idea, but I think what they are doing is they are preparing for the humans versus zombies apocalypse. And HBZ. they're just gonna, they're gonna finally take care of all those people and we will not have to see that game ever again. 2012, right? 2012. Yeah. 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 It's a joke. Come on, come on. <laughs> All right, Every, everyone is, is all excited about this new iPad, correct? Right, it, it's, it's the and latest hype. I actually saw one myself recently on TV, because I'm banned from all uh, iStores. Why? 
Long story. Okay. Uh, <laughs> the lady at the, the store won't let me in anymore. And, uh, uh, but they actually have uh, this thing called Scrabble on the iPad. Mm -hmm. And you can use your iPhone to hold your letters. And then you can place the letters onto the iPad via no iPhone. No way. you got to be kidding me. Or, or iTouch. Yeah. No, no, I'm not kidding. Um, or else, for $11,000 cheaper, you can just buy the real game. <laughs> So wait a minute, wait a minute. That's so if you have four players, that's four iPhones. Yeah, that's, that's like, a lot of money. That's a lot that's of money. A, that's like twelve assault rifles. <laughs> Anyways, we have a big show today. It's it's an hour long. It's our season finale. So uh, we will be right back after this. All right, everybody, go ahead and quiet down. We're going to go ahead and get started. This is the last day of our video seminar, so we're just going to be going over some filmmaking tips. Are there any specific questions that you guys wanted to answer? Yeah, I always see these movies with green screens. When is the good time to use a green screen? That's a very good question. It's a little bit difficult to explain, so what I'm going to do is show you. The most common reason to use a green screen is to go somewhere you're not. Ah, look at me, I'm on the moon, I'm in outer space. Actually, this is pretty stupid. Check this out. Can you make your own episode of Blue's Clues? Whoa! This might be a good one for you. You can even make yourself a new friend. You can even make yourself a floating head. It doesn't have to be just your head either. You can just start swimming around. You can even do kung fu moves too. You can even stand on a wall. Better yet, you can finally do a cartwheel. All right. Probably the most practical one, though, is you can finally yell bomb in an airport. Everybody get down, I got a bomb, I got a bomb! But there are two things you need to remember. You can't really wear green at all. You can't interact with other objects. Oh, hey, thanks. Oh, hey, Nathan. All right, are there any other questions at all? Me, 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 me